think it's it's nice and cool at this time of the morning. We've got so, the best cushion patong with it. The best cushion patong? The best thing. Getting hammered by water. <laughs> oh, I thought you were getting yeah, hammered really by a lady. I thought you said getting hammered by a lady boy or no. something. But you can speak Thai then. No, need no. Put Thai, die need no. But you can speak Thai, die need no. Open the uh, festival of the Songkran festival or the Thai, thai New Year. Okay. Arun Sawa. Too early. So, guys, guess what? It's seven in the morning. People are either just going back, going to sleep after party. Or just starting their day. Even at 7 a.m. in the morning, things are winding down. 7:30, I think, in the morning, people are either going home or the vendors are setting up again, ready for another day. These people work very hard. The grind is on. Look, all the taxi, motorcycles, motorbike taxis are all out. See, all these guys are all working hard. Now these vans, these vans carry travellers from the airport to the hotels or wherever they're staying. I'm, uh, this area, I'm not far away from Bangalore. Okay bro. Hey, what's happening? Where, tell the people yes. where you're from. Yes, I'm from Switzerland. Yes, yeah, Sabah. This guy, I don't know where you're from, <laughs> but... Me, I was a Yes, I speak French. Yeah, yeah, Blaine. Blaine. Yes. Your name is Blaine. Yes. Yeah, Shem Hey, hold. Hey, you drink, huh? You drink. Oh, it's water. <laughs> no water, no water. What? More, more, more. <laughs> so, what are you doing up so early in the morning? Yeah, I just go into Villa. I finish my night, yes. But for the moment, it's not the night. Yeah? No? Okay. <laughs> no. Okay, nice, Sam. Okay. okay, merci. Merci, mon gars. Merci, my man. Thanks, brother. Hey, You're the man. Toi. See, see okay, you. okay, see you later, brother. Oh, this was up. <laughs> and we up so early. And you know, the reason why I got up early to do this vlog. It's because I know, just wanted to see you guys what it takes for these people to grind in this in these places because they set up every day around this time and they stay until about midnight. And you know, and they get their work done and then How are you doing? Morning, what? Yeah. Where are you from? Uh, New Zealand. New Zealand? You speak Thai? Nidnoi. 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 You smoke put, marijuana? Put Thai. Put, put Thai dai nidnoi. Put Thai dai nidnoi. Oh. Yeah. Still good, but that's still good. Still oh, good. That's it. Sabai, sabai. Thank you. I'm going for a walk. I might okay, come back later. Okay. We got so, the best cushion patong with it. The best cushion patong? The best, yeah. the best. Yeah. Is this where all the tourists uh, come down? They have to come here if they come to patong with it. Yeah. What's your name, brother? Moiki. Moiki. You Thai? Thai. Yeah. Thai? Oh, yeah, me too. Oh, thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay. okay. Thank you. Lag on. Chicken. Yeah. yeah. Bye, Lana. Yeah, see you. Okay. Bye, Lana. So, yeah. <laughs> see, even the guys operating the weed spots are all up early in the morning to get be on the grind. So, Thailand's a Buddhist uh, country. And um, this is some of the offering like little shrines offering the god so and I always see this they always have like Fanta and stuff for the offering you know I always see that they always have like soft drinks Fanta and stuff so kind festival it's still going. 
these days. So I've got to be careful. People, people still walk around with their big war pistols and they're still trying to wet people. Look at this. Guy, guy shot me uh, when I was walking down here. But it's okay. It's all in the spirit of the you know, festival. This brother here. Oh. Okay. Early morning. morning. Thought I'd get around with these dudes to avoid people shooting me with their guns. So. You know the other the other thing is it's nice and cool at this time of the morning. In the afternoon it's just too hot to you know it's too hot to shoot videos. So I, that's another reason why I'm doing videos in this time of the morning. It's nice to show you people what it's like, you know, the calm before the storm. So cruising through a um, street here in uh, Patong Beach. Don't forget people subscribe to the channel. If you're new, welcome to the channel and uh, tell a friend to tell a friend. You know, we're building a community right here. Right now we're giving you content from here in uh, Patong Beach, Phuket, Thailand. So I hope you people are enjoying this. Oh good brother. So, bye. Bye, bye, bye. Bye, D. D, D Mark. Ah, D Mark. vlogs let's go okay let's uh Okay, stopping off here at the beach. Captain Cap. Captain Cap. Captain Cap. 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 My man, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Just got a little ride down here to the beach from around the corner look at this this is what the beach looks like before anything kicks off all the beach chairs are up people walking around the beach look at this so this is Patong Beach before it gets crazy the time now it's about quarter to eight in the morning or maybe 7 30. look at this so, look how beautiful the beach is and believe me by the afternoon it's going to be bodies and bodies and bodies. A lot of people come here. But it's been too hot lately. You know, this time of the year, it's very hot. It was 38 degrees. Yesterday it was like 39, 40. 
I just couldn't go out. <laughs> so I decided, you know what, I'm going to come early in the morning just to show you people the beach early in the morning. Not only, not only that, it's really cool to see, um, you know, what, what it looks like before the chaos starts, before the day starts. You know, this one's nice and calm, beautiful. water the sun the sun is rising now there's still quite a few people on the beach walking around so I thought hey the Tong Beach so beautiful and calm this is before everyone gets here it's uh, going until 8 a.m. in the morning so when I was living in Sydney I used to come to Thailand quite a bit you know holidays with people and but this is way before the channel started always like this place just great vibes you know look at this it's this beach here in the afternoon see all these beach chairs in front of me they, they will all be occupied so let's go up to the street man Early in the morning, and there's a lot of people in already walking around. You know, it's one of those things, you know, when you go on holiday, you know, when you're away overseas and stuff like that, you always want to get up early and get, you know, have a look around. So we can capture the moments. And it's moments like this that I like getting up. And then I go for a walk and the vendors are just starting. You know, these guys are just sitting there. Business is up. I don't say what. Man, it always amazes me the work ethic of these people. You know, every day, wake up early in the morning, put, you know, set their little stalls up, and then they grind again. They won't leave you till midnight. You know, that's a lot. That's a lot of effort, and that's you know, their work ethic is it's too much. Morning, Alun Sawat. Yeah. Yeah. So. And this lady's already cooking. What has she got here? This is this area here. I usually stay around. I usually stay around this area, but this time around. I couldn't get a place around this area because every place was booked out. I'll tell you what, the weed game is really serious here. There's a lot of stops, a lot of vendors. Look, look at this. Happy bar. Okay, smoking weed, of course you'll be happy. The happy bar. Got the buds, so then they're not started yet. So, if you're in Patong Beach, you will find a happy bar if you want to be happy. You want to get lifted. So, that's the place to come get lifted. So, I've only been here for like a few days here in uh, Patong. But I tell you what, there was uh, the first day I came out and it was just so hot I feel drained, you know. The second day, I didn't really do much because... I was going to shoot some uh, content, but it was just too hot. It was 39 degrees. 
38, it was just, bro, you know, if I would have walked down, my shoes would have been melting. My Crocs would be dead, be dead Crocs on the road. But today it's nice and uh, nice, it's a nice cool air in the morning. So, Captain Cat. So what's oh there's something happening down here. Let's go down the beach, there's something happening. Hello! Hello! Arun Sawat! Hey, Arun Sawat. Okay. I think this is all part of the festival or well, salt brand without a spell, but children. So, here, you, is it offering? What's this? Like you can say, the, to open the ceremony for okay. open, open the uh, festival of the Songkran festival or the Thai, Thai New Year. Okay, nice. Okay, so all this offering here, water. So. So there's a lot of uh, people down here. It's like um, giving thanks and offerings, and you know, to get you know uh, the festival started. The Songkran 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 festival started. So people are already gathering. I'm down here in Phuket in the start of um, the Songkran uh, festival. I've heard some people say Song Grand, some people say Song Gan, and that's all locals, so I don't know which one. I think Song Grand, Song Grand, Song Gan, Song Grand, <laughs> yeah. But me and me and the boys, uh, me, Raw, and Dulu were here a few years back. I'm in a yard now, we call, <laughs> call this place a yard. It's a registration for. Hello, Sawad, Sawad Kap, Alun Sawad. So, this is uh, the beginning of uh, the of the Thai New Year over here today. There. Okay. Thank you. Kapun Kap. Kapun Kap. Start of the New Year's of the Thai Thai New Year, Songkran, and it's early in the morning. These people are down here, so. I just wanted to come down and walk around and show you people what's up. The cops police station here. So this is this is one place that you you don't one place you don't really want to find yourself in. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> see see that? On Patong Beach. See everybody on their best get-ups, got their Hawaiian shirts on and Thai attire as well. So festivity. So people are bringing water. See all the locals? They bring water because it's a water festival. So they bring a lot of water and stuff like that for it. See here. And right down here on Patong Beach. So yeah, here in Patong is starting to get busy now. It's 8.30 in the morning, people are moving around, you know. They don't sleep here by the looks of it. The vendors are out unpacking, ready to get their day started. I mean, good thing about this place, you come down here, you feel the energy. Love um, 
Patong Beach. We love Thailand, you know, great place. Vibes are always on 100. And So now there's a lot of movement now. People are starting their day. It's eight o'clock, just after eight o'clock in the morning. And so this is where it all happens. Patong Beach. I was here for Song Grand the first day. And this is what it looks like in the daytime before it happens. And it's gonna to happen tonight again. So. Could you guys believe that this uh, was the street I was on, on, you know, on Song Grand, first day? Because it's quiet right now because it's too early. It's after eight, so they don't set up. Probably about 10 o'clock, but it's gonna be crazy again. So I'll see, I might come back down here because it's gonna be all on again. I just thought I'd come out early and give you guys some content this morning because it was nice and cool. Because when it gets too hot, it's really hard to shoot, you know, to, to film in the heat I mean the heat here I thought you know after living in Australia for a long time I'll be used to it but I think I've been in New Zealand just a, a bit too long because I come down when I came here the heat was just too, on another level you know because it's, even the heat is levels to that game levels to this heat game so this is the main uh, nightclub section of Bangla Road I'm here in Bangla Road the most famous Bangla Road walking street here in uh, in Patong Beach. This is where all the actions is, all the clubs, you name it, it's all here. Everybody knows this spot here. But this is what it looks like when it's pretty quiet. Hello. Hello, how are you bro? Morning. Where are you going? I'm walking, doing video. Oh, you're walking. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, how are you? Sabai di mai. Sabai di kap. Ah, sabai di. Oh, that smokes man. Okay, thank you. Kapkun ka, brother. Okay, my man. Where you come from, sir? Ah, uh, uh, New Zealand. New Zealand. Yeah. Hey, you, you, same, same Asia. Put Thai. Ah. Yeah. Ah, uh, put, no, no, me. Um, put Thai. Thai, Thai, Ninoi. But you put in Greek? Little put Pasai in Greek? Little bit. Need noi. In Greek, Tima. Okay, Kapkun ka. YouTuber. Yeah. Ah, YouTuber. Yeah, YouTuber. Ah. Yeah. Okay. Kapun kap. So, the guy said I look Thai. So, that's a good thing. I look like a local. What? Well, coming from a Thai guy. See, I look at Thais. They're quite similar. This is like smaller Pacific Islanders. These are our brothers and sisters here in, in Southeast Asia. So, gotta love these people. Anyway, look, let's continue. So this. Nam. Nam. I have water. And I'm good, thank you. Tao Rai. 20 baht. 20 baht. So, 20 baht. 9 baht in 7 Eleven. <laughs> yeah, I'll find. Let's see, let's see what I have. I'll get some more. Put. Malaysia. Malaysia? You. Yes. Me Malaysia? I don't know. Malaysia? Keep going. Malaysia? No. Uh, uh, my. China? No. Oh dear. Take that. So Nam. And where you from? Me, me, Chad, pretend New Zealand. New Zealand? Thai. You don't look. You don't look New Zealand. I look Thai. Me Thai? 
I look Malay Malaysia. You look Asian. I'm Asian. Yes. Oh wow, that's the first time I've heard of that one. I look Asian. <laughs> okay, cup, good cup. But why you can speak Thai then? No, need noi. Um, put Thai, Thai need noi. Why you can speak Thai, Thai need noi? YouTube. <laughs> Really? Yeah. Put you speak put Pasa in Greek. No put Thai. Uh me put Thai my dad. <laughs> put Okay, cup good cup. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah, Bailana. Good one. Oh well, bought a water from that lovely lady. Thais are so friendly. But early in the morning and we got our walk on and believe me this is so good walking here right now how cool it is this morning hey brother hey bros how are you where you from brother sydney australia bro sydney oh yeah where are you from what a sick camp where are you from <laughs> from sydney too bro oh yeah whereabouts no nah, no nah, i used to live in sydney i'm from wellington new zealand yeah well, what where about in uh in, in sydney you at uh Parramatta, brother Para. Parramatta. Eels are bro. Up the was. Up the was. Man, the eels, the eels hasn't been good since Sterling was playing. <laughs> since the 80s, brother. Hey, bro, um, yeah. Walla, you, you, Lebanese? Yeah, yeah. Oh, Lebanese. Walla, Walla, Habibi. Habibi. What's your name? Ah, uh, Cos. Cos, brother. Nice yeah, I used to live in Blacktown. Oh, yeah. I'm 12 years in Sydney. I was in Blacktown and I was on Bondi. Oh, yeah, nice. Holsworthy. Parramatta's not far from Blacktown. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I'm all down. Yeah, uh, I know minutes. Church Street, my man. Mm. Yeah, what do you know about Church Street? <laughs> <laughs> what are you off to now? I'm just having a coffee, checking out what's happening, going back to the room for breakfast. And, and how how was um how's how's the how's the holiday be for you? Good, mate. It yeah. has been really good. Yesterday was nuts. I've never seen yeah. shit like this in my life. Oh wow! We're just getting hammered down here. Getting hammered. Ah. Getting, don't get too hammered. Uh, you'll wake up with a lady boy. Getting hammered by water. <laughs> oh, I thought you getting hammered by. Walk, I thought man. you said getting hammered by a lady boy or no, something. I'll, I'll, do, I'll, I'll hammer the lady boy. <laughs> hey, I didn't say that. He did. So you guys in para, but you see my man in para matter. See, that's that's, I always saw these eels fans were a bit funny. You gotta watch this for these. They're quite slippery. These eels fans. <laughs> Oh, my man. Oh, God All right, you. bro. Nice hey. to meet you. Okay, brother. We'll see hey, you around. Check out the YouTube channel. Yep. Got it. On your phone. Yep. So you'll probably see yourself no on worries. it, brother. What is it? Cause I can. Cause I can. K-O-S. K-O-S. Space I space can. That? Yeah. Nice okay, to brother. Hey, too we'll much? Have a drink soon. Okay. See you, brother. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta love it. You know, all this good pants when you meet Aussies. That guy was far Lebanese Australian from Parramatta. Parramatta eels. Up the was. Come on. Okay. Wow, these guys are still partying. <laughs> Illusion staff is still partying. Oh, must be crazy last night. <laughs> now, see you tonight. Illusion. So, this place here, guys, Illusions Bar. It's one of the biggest clubs here in uh, Patong. This club here, it's... So the Illusions Bar, that's where it all goes down. I've been there a few times over the years, but I think my clubbing days are over. We'll stick to the YouTube game. Keep rolling. Elena Lounge. Okay, that's it. Peace out. Too early, brother. I'm going to the hotel for breakfast. Thank you, brother. Yeah. So, after the walk, I just come down here, get some breakfast. Hi, yeah. I'm Mandy. What's nice it? to meet you. Kanchiwara. Uh, Mandika. Mandika. <laughs> yeah. Mandika. Oh, good morning, Arun Sawad. Oh, lovely. So, omelet. breakfast. This is breakfast, uh, omelette. Yes. So, coffee. So after our lovely walk, I thought I'd come down and get some um, breakfast. So toast, oh, pretty basic, but it's nice. Yeah, let's see what they what they got here. They got morning. Uh, so got eggs. Okay, tomatoes and eggs, tomatoes. 
potatoes and they got oh Thai green curry as well okay I know what I'm having and also it's not too bad bad words here for one of salad watermelon and we got good old Stobbly, Stobbly jam. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna just make, just pop some toast, pop some toast in the in the toaster. So yeah, just after our, our walk, come down here, have breakfast. Then I'm gonna go upstairs and probably do some editing. Gotta get these videos out. So this is where I'm staying at the moment. Uh, when I came here, the place that I originally booked in kind of double booked me, only gave me two nights instead of five. So I looked around because it's so packed, it's so busy here in Patong Beach because in, in Phuket because of the Songkran, uh, you know, a festival, the Thai New Year. So every place is practically booked out and lucky I found this place like last minute. So let me get some breakfast. Thing. We've got cereal. We've got cereal. Coffee. No. And chef over there, busy chefing up the the eggs. So let's let's get something to eat. Get our plate. This is breakfast guys, toast, green curry, rice, fried tomatoes, omelette and scrambled eggs, potatoes. Yeah people, morning people, Arun Sawat from Thailand, from Phuket, just had a morning walk and now it's breakfast time. So thank God for this um, breakfast and bless this breakfast and thank you. Hope you people having a good morning or day, night, whatever time it is, where we're watching from. So when you stay at this hotel, they give you a free breakfast, so it wasn't too bad. And it was the last minute because the hotel that I did book in, kind of uh, double booked me, they can only give me two nights instead of the five that I needed. So I found, like quickly, lucky this came up, wasn't many hotels going around the area that I wanted, what, and that I wanted to stay. Not many hotels in the area that I wanted to stay. This one's a bit out from where I usually stay, but it's still good. They give you good breakfast, so let's enjoy our breakfast, eh? And the cream curry. The cream curry looks good. Mmm. Mm. Cream curry. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, man. Yeah, so hope you people enjoying the videos. So let me get to my breakfast. Just wanted to show you what the breakfast is like buffet in this uh, hotel. You know, it's, it's all right. You know, I've been I've been to worse, believe me. But this people here are very friendly. Great place. And having breakfast, free breakfast in this buffet, you can help yourself have as, as much breakfast as you want. <laughs> Basically, for you know, for all price of the of the hotel, and believe me, this place that I'm staying is actually quite pretty good. It's around three hundred dollars New Zealand, probably around two two ninety Australian to stay here and for five nights and free breakfast. So, pretty good deal if you ask me. I mean, we don't need nothing flash. We here to, to grind, we here to give you guys videos. So let me get into my breakfast and uh, see you guys on the next video. Salute, so stay in the boss lane. Boss up, create your own lane. That's how we do it in this channel. So thank you.